Welcome to the new online student orientation. This video will walk you through the layout of this course and explain the requirements. This course is set up very similar to the other online courses you will be taking. Each instructor is able to customize certain parts of the course, but the basics will stay the same. Each instructor will customize the home page according to what will be important in their course. Some of the more popular widgets are news, calendar, talent technical support, and content browser. The grades, progress, and calendar links will not be used in this course. Information on how to use these links in your future online courses can be found in the Welcome to Talon course listed in your course's homepage. The email link will allow you to send an email to your instructor or other students in your course. Any email sent from this link will go to the person's Kirkwood email address. It will not be contained inside Talon. Responses to your questions will not come to Talon, but to your Kirkwood email address. For this course, the email feature has been disabled. The library link will take you directly to Kirkwood's Library Services webpage. The Library Services page is a great resource when writing papers or just looking for information. The online help link will take you directly to D2L's Resource Center webpage. You can watch video tutorials and find other helpful information on this site. The overview, bookmarks, and upcoming events links will also not be used in this course. Information on how to use these links in your future online courses can be found in the Welcome to Talon course listed in your course's homepage. In a normal course, the syllabus is the best place to start. It will contain important information about your course, such as instructor contact information, what is expected that each student will learn, how the course is graded, and specific course policies. You might also find assignment due dates and tips to help you be successful in your online course. You can find it in one of your course modules or as its own module. The location will depend on the instructor. For this course, there are 10 modules to complete. Each module's quiz must be completed with an 80% or higher before you have access to the next module. For this course, you will start by clicking on the Start Here link. You will start the orientation by completing the What's Your Program quiz in the Start Here module. This is where you will select what major you chose when you did your application. This will tailor the information at the end of this orientation to your specific degree. After you've completed the Choose Your Program quiz, Lesson 1 will appear. Each lesson will contain videos, links to websites, and documents. Once you've viewed all the content in each folder, there will be a quiz to complete. Each quiz must be completed in lesson order with an 80% or higher. The next module will not be made available until you have scored at least an 80% on your previous quiz. If you have closed out of your quiz, you can view your score by going into that module, click on the quiz, click on the drop-down arrow next to the quiz name, and select View Submissions. Once you've completed the quizzes in Lessons 1 through 8, you will be ready to contact your advisor. Click on the Last Step Program Requirements link. The major you selected during the What's Your Program quiz will be listed. Look through the information and complete the short acknowledgement quiz. To be cleared to register, you must complete this course with at least an 80% as well as talk to your program advisor. Good luck with your orientation. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact our office at any time.